to another jam-packed program. It is I, the artiste, Denzel, program specialist from Girl Scouts of County. Today what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a great, great landscape scenery. Um, I was gonna use the water, um, washable watercolors and my paintbrush until I stumbled across this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful thing here. It's a stencil book. Some of you guys may have some. Maybe you guys can make some stencils out of like paper. You can like print them and cut them out. So I'm gonna actually use this to my advantage because I see that they have some buildings and some weather and stuff like that in here. Maybe some animals. So we're gonna do that. So the first thing I wanna do, I wanna make a like big like city landscape, All right? So I'm gonna go to these uh, these building ones. Just gotta, gotta rip these out. like a concrete jungle you know so okay i can't rip anything all right so let's just see if we have any more city ones that we would like to use um i think that's pretty much it um i think i'm gonna rip out the the letters in it so maybe i could title my city huh? Huh? maybe So let's make our first skyscraper. Um, I'm thinking, let's make it, let's make it, mm, look at like a black maybe. That looks like our first building. <laughs> okay, cool. So we're gonna make another one. are made so far so good let's make another big one over here we'll color it maybe we'll put like maybe a different color always have your little paper towel and your little water cup ready and handy so that you can just dip and uh, reset your paintbrush um, a big blue building. Get a nice touch of blue in there. We'll just use a uh, building there. Reset this again. <clears throat> All right. So now let's see if we can make like uh, hmm. Let's keep having these buildings together. What we're going to do is we're going to make a buildings and then we're gonna make a landscape behind it, maybe like uh, some bridges. This is all ideal, I'm, I'm not an artist. Make sure we get this off a little bit more. Still, still damp. All right, let's go with a red building.
If you guys want to use colored pencils, that might be easier, but I chose to use the paint to bring out the full inner artist. <laughs> okay. Building made. Now I should probably make another one. I'll put them right next to each other once this dries. Put another red one in there. Sweet. So we got another building. So far, this is very abstract, but this is just our buildings. We're gonna get what well, all this cools off and dries off. We're going to make maybe like a sky for it. Um, let's title it. How about that? What should what should we name our city? City of Townsville. <laughs> no, no, just kidding. Um, let's see. Let's make it over here. Give it a big old C. Um, I'm gonna do a I. Very careful here. Who knew art takes such precision? An eye. A T. Somehow it's it's looking good and it's not not getting wet, so we're in good standing right now. Give it a Y. Ooh, Y came out good. Now it's City What. We don't have a name for it, so let's just call it City X. Ho ho. All right, let's just show you what we've made so far. I don't want to show you because it's gonna it's gonna drip, but you can see city X on top, got our city down. The basis of our city.
was made. Even though there's not much grass in a metropolitan setting, we got some grass here. And then just make a little sun. And let this dry for time for time constraints. Um, we're gonna, you know, we'll let this dry and then I'll start. I want to do an underwater one with you guys. So you guys can decorate the city one as much as you want, but I want to show you another one just to show you guys that we can paint more. I think there's a sun in here. If not, we can do our little corner, corner sun trick. Oh, there is a sun in here. Look at that. This stencil book has been highly, oh. That doesn't even look like a sun, really. Yeah, it's a sun, I guess. Looks like an action, like a pow. All right, so we have a little orange. Not sure if this looks like a sun or not, but uh, we'll figure that out later. And the sun. <laughs> Looks like an orange splat. Like we just dropped <laughs> orange paint on it. But yeah, so this right now is City X. City X is drying right now. So come back, we'll take a break, you know, and get a snack or something. We'll come back and we'll paint our underwater scene. All right, see you guys in a second. All right, so we're back with the artiste. Um, so we're gonna do our underwater scene. I'm gonna do is I'm gonna paint the whole thing blue, give this some time to dry, and then we'll come back and we'll decorate all the little stuff on top. So right now we're gonna get this as blue as possible. Um, let's just start there. First things first. I wanna make like a little surface for it. So now we're gonna do the whole thing blue on top of that.
dry. So we have our marine animal stencils. Um, so because this is all blue, we have to go some different colors for some of these animals. So if you see a purple octopus, well, octopus is probably purple, but a purple whale, just know you couldn't use blue. Okay? All right. Let's first start <clears throat> with this sub submarine boat. Actually, no, let's go with the shark first. Put him at the bottom. Give him an action like right here. Put him right here. Give him, give him a red shark. This shark may turn out to be a little purple. That's okay, because I already gave you my disclaimer. Shark is done. That's like a shark, right? Yeah, a little decision on the face. Okay, all right. So this shark <clears throat> is coming up to the water for some reason, right? It's gotta be for a fish. So we're gonna do a couple schools of fishes or school of fish. My fish are kind of in like orange blobs, but that's all you guys need to know. <laughs> that's why we have to use not that much uh, paint when we're using the big stuff, the big items, or painting the big items. All right, so we're gonna make this big giant whale. Let's make this whale, let's make this whale purple. Actually, whale shaped instead of a big purple blob. Okay. Um. Yeah. It, yeah. Because of the orange, it's smeared on there, so our whale looks like a big thing. So let's do our submarine. Submarine should be a 
clarity three. Still black. Right, I'm sorry. There you go, black black submarine. <laughs> As you can see, we've made our underwater sea. We may use our stencils. We've tried the best of our abilities to be creative and artistic. Um, so I want you guys to show what you guys have painted and created. Um, you can send it in to us on Facebook at Girl Scouts of County or Instagram at Girl Scouts underscore SC. Um, this has been another jam-packed artistic virtual program with Denzel, the fabulous artiste. So stay tuned and um, you'll get another program soon. Peace.